Hello, I'm Johnny and welcome back to my kitchen. I'm in a very cheerful mood today because it's about to rain and I just love it when it's raining and get so inspired. Um, so what was I going to say? <laughs> this is an unboxing. Um, oh my God, what was that? <gasps> Jumped out my skin there. Um, I placed an order with Under the Rowan Trees um for the quarterly subscription box just a one-off order it was 35 pound but they said they'll start posting on the 9th and i think we're only on the 6th now so hopefully this is not it because i paid 35 pound and i just assumed the box would be bigger because they also do a monthly one which is 25 pounds and it's in this size box so fingers crossed um i got a coupon look on um yoli open stuff um i think she gets the boxes free so she can do reviews and she leaves a code and i got i used a code and it was i got five pound 44 knocked off which is brilliant so i'll leave her details down below and you can check her channel out and get the code if you want it um i've got other boxes to unbox so i'll show you this one first let's get into it i have done uh, under the rowan trees unboxing in the past uh, i bought three boxes in the sale and i just wasn't impressed uh with the amount of things you got for 25 pound so let's see oh yeah this is my order Thank you so much for supporting our small business. Love, Danielle, India and Samantha. So this is the socials if you want to check them out. So I ordered this. It's a, an erasable pen, but I just absolutely loved the design of this and it feels so nice. This will be the erasable bit. Look, it's got an astronaut on, planets, rocket, space explorer. I just think it's so nice. And how do you get the lid off? Right, so let's see. Right in black. I should have let it dry first, shouldn't I? Because it's smudged. And it does erase. Um, I think it'll erase better on paper than this uh, glossy card. And I should have let it dry because it's smudged. <laughs> but just a really nice pen and I think that was £2.35 and then I uh, got this washi tape they'd done a previous box and it was a witchy type box and I didn't realise that you could order do you know like from past boxes just various pieces that you like because you might not like the full box but you like the bits and pieces I mean I haven't got much of a use for washi tape might do in the future but I do like this it's gorgeous and then I got this I mean easy enough to make uh, if you're a sewer which I am but I just really like the colour and it's made by Buckaroo I do like their products and it's a pen pouch for notebooks and journals um, I'll go and get my journal and show you I recently bought this book from um, Amazon. You got two books, uh, an A6 one, and the A6 one was blue, and it's got like a little pocket at the front, which is quite nice. And you got a free yellow pen, and it was only eleven ninety nine. So let's get into that. There, I've opened it now. Uh, this is the other book that you got. It's the little A5 one and it's got a nice little pocket in the front. 
uh, by Buckaroo. And then you get this pen. These normally go for $3.99. So $11.99 for two books and a pen. Brilliant. Uh, Buckaroo notebook, scribble list note or sketch your important ideas in this useful A5 book. I did say that was A6, but you know anyway, don't you? Right, so it shows you all the little notebooks and gadgets they do. This one's a phone holder. That's the pen holder. Then you get one with glasses holder. And this one you can put your, um, what do you call them? Earphones and things in. Um, yeah, I think they're really handy things. So, I mean, if you're a sawyer, you'll be able to knock one of these up, no problem. Uh, it was a really nice one I liked and it was a William Morris thing but it was $12.99 this was $8.99 so I decided to get this one because I don't know about you but if you know you can make it yourself it puts you off buying it and this just goes around here Now, I expected this to be super tight and I'd have a struggle putting it on. I mean, I am struggling, but it's only because I've got gammy hands. Come on, get on now. God, I am struggling getting it on. Right, there, that's it. So there we go, really nice. Let's see, shove the pens in. Now that's a bit tight, but I suppose it has to be so it doesn't fall out in your bag. Can I get this one in? Well, I'd shove a, a pen and a pencil in there. Yeah, really liking that. Next, I didn't order these. I did order some stickers, but not these. Oh, I hope they've sent the other ones. The other stickers were uh, colourful. Go in a bit more. Right, so what's this? Oh yes, really like these. Love the illustrations on them. I think they're supposed to be Christmas cards. Well, winter cards. But the illustrations are just so nice. Gorgeous. Oh, look at that. Ziggy is sitting in the box. <laughs> and it's very shallow, Ziggy. <laughs> That one's gorgeous. I think it's watercolour. Feels like watercolour paper. That one's very nice. So there's four cards. These were the sale items and four envelopes. And that was from the Wicker previous box, as was the washi tape. Uh, and that's unfortunate. I haven't got the stickers I wanted, but they're all right, I guess. And then these illustration cards, which I really like. Oh, do you get two of each? I mean, they'll be all right in scrapbooking or just learning how to draw. Oh, that's cute. I don't know who the illustrator is. Unfortunately, I forgot to write an R. I know it was a lady. Forgot to write her name down so I could mention it in this video. 
or if you're interested, look on the website and the Wicca, Wicca After Dark subscription box. Um, look on that and it'll tell you the artist's name. Yeah, so I love them. Got them stickers. Washi tape. And the Christmas cards. That was the sale items I bought. And this. Yeah, so I am liking that. So I will just wait for the subscription box when they start sending them out on the 9th. Um, thank you, Yoli, for the code. So I will get on to the next unboxing. Can't put them back in the box because Ziggy's jumped in it. Right, next unboxings are two scrawler boxes. There was a really good sale on in the scrawler box, and because I subscribe, you yeah, join, you can join the oh gosh, I forgot what it's called. Is it Sub Club? I think it's called. And you yeah, do uh, free items, and there was a lucky bag, but unfortunately, I missed that, and they were all sold out, and you got various pens from previous boxes uh, this one you got for free I do like these they are Derwent line makers and I got a 0 0.8 because I do love a chunky monkey marker line maker so that was free and then I got um, because I'm in the sub club, you get an extra £2 off, and uh, they were half price. Were they half price? Is it more than half price? Well, I got them £10 a box. Yeah, so I think the boxes go for £24.95, so yes, more than half price. So, let's get into them. And I don't know if the sale's still on. But um, this was one of my favourite boxes um, just because of this concertina book in it. Because I wasn't uh, very keen on the... Oh, well, I won't tell you in case you haven't seen it. What's inside? So, right. I just absolutely love this pen. Um, I think I bought a pass box. I've got two. I was wanting to give me mum this one, and it's uh, absolutely gorgeous. It's made from how many? Ten plastic bottles, and it's the pattern. Well, it just looks like a plastic bottle. Absolutely gorgeous. Love it, and I think they're selling this um on the website for one pound twenty five. I was going to buy it and then I really wanted another Constantina book so I thought I may as well just buy the box. And it's made by Pilot and it's a, what is it, B, B2P Eco Ball. Yeah, so if you want to know more you can either pause this and read it or look them up. Look, Ziggy's pulling me tissue paper now. Ziggy wants to be on in the action. In on the action. Um, there's a sweet, and I think it'll be past its sell by date now. Um, Dish of the day. I enjoyed that prompt. Uh, there's the little sticker. And we got a blender pen. I'm not a fan of these at all. Let's have a sniff again. Yes, smell to high heaven. Um, and these pencils, I wasn't um, very fussed on the pencils. But I mean, they're all right pencils. It's just the colours, they seemed very muted, dull. I just wasn't fussed on them. I mean, I will use them. Nothing goes to waste. And if not, I can give them them to one of my friends 
Right, do you want that tissue paper, Ziggy? There you go, play with that. Yep. Right, so that was the box. Right, the next box. Oh, God, look, I haven't got this out ever. <laughs> Bye. Getting distracted today. So, this is the concertina book, and I just love these. My friend Gabby gave me one, but it was a different size. Can't get it out the box. There. Very useful. I think it's a uh, sea white paper. Love that. And then, what else did we get, Siggy? This is the artwork for that box, and the illustrator is, I can't pronounce it, Yu Tong Wang. And that is gorgeous. And then, the scroller zine. Just gives you some things to try, tips, sit down with a featured artist and it tells you in the front of the items you get in the box. Right, next box, Ziggy. Open sesame. Do you want that? Off in one, off in one, off in one. Right. And this box was also a favourite of mine. Probably guess where it is. Oh, Ziggy, you're attacking me. The Sennelier box. Just absolutely love these. So we get the... Is it the primary colour? No, it's not. You get a mustard brown, a yellow, a blue, a dark blue, a black and a white. And um, an eraser, which is also always handy. You get the sticker. Where rivers flow. I absolutely love this box and the prompt. And I uh, got me artwork. The first time I tried these out and it turned out smashing and my artwork was featured in the zine. Uh, then we get a stump. Very useful for blending the colours. And then this Mars Lumograph, one of, I think it is actually my favourite pencil ever. I just love using these pencils. And then we get, these are also gorgeous, Spearmint Chew. And there's a, that's like a scratchy tool for when you lay the, um, Wax pastel down, oil pastel down, and then you can make shapes in it, which the, I'll show you, the illustrator has done here. And this is their artwork, and the illustrator is Julie Avasar. I think I'll follow her on Instagram. And then we get some drawn paper, which is very handy at the moment because I'm doing loads of sketches for Inktober and Scrolltober. Um, this is the magazine. Well, you're sitting happy there, Ziggy, on that tissue paper. Look at the scroller zine. Artist's advice, tips and tricks, sit down with the artist and tells you more about the products. I just absolutely love them. And they just look good enough to eat, but of course you can't. Got some else to show you. I was going to say bye now, but I may as well show you. Just CDs. I recently watched um, all the Resident Evil movies. Absolutely brilliant. I so, saw the theme music. Uh, do you know where a song just plays around in your head and you just want to know? So I just bought these. And some of the artists, was it Slipknot, Marilyn Manson, which I do like. Uh, Depatch Mode, that's the only ones I know, and Fifty Shades, I started watching their, all their movies. I mean, I always skip through the sexual bits, because even when I'm sitting on my own, it makes me feel embarrassed, and 
So I just speed it all up, but I think it's a really nice love story and the music is excellent. So I bought that. And it's got Taylor Swift's in, um, John Legend, The Dream, Sia, Helium. Absolutely love that. So just thought I'd show you that. I got this from Amazon for a fiver. And I just got these from eBay for a few quid. Um, sorry if it was very upsetting seeing my face in the reflection. But it doesn't seem to be bothering Ziggy. Anyway, so that is that. So turning out from an unboxing to CDs and yeah, whatever. Anyway, Johnny signing out. Are you signing out too, Ziggy? Eh? Oh, look, you're biting me. Oh my God. What a swine. Johnny signing out. See you, bye.